check this out. We are packed for sup boarding, kayaking, tubing, snorkeling. And we're gonna do it all. Hey everybody, Rick and Nikki here at Blue Spring State Park in Orange City, Florida. We have the inflatables, her sup, my kayak all blown up. Let's hit the water. Okay guys, we are out on the water. We'll tell you more about this place as we go about our day. Like I said, this is Blue Spring State Park in Orange City, Florida. About a 30 minute drive from downtown Orlando. The cost to get in, $6 per vehicle, unless you're by yourself, then it's only $4. I think to start with, we'll paddle down to the mouth of the spring. Check out these trees along the way. Along this way, there is a boardwalk and several different spots where you can just look out over the water and look at the wildlife. Uh, manatee like to come here a lot. I don't know if we'll see one today, but different little overhangs where you can stand and just look for the manatee. Can you guys see that fish right there? And then I've been told there's a manatee right up there. There's two right there. There's two right there, a mama manatee and a baby manatee. Just took their nose up. Now you see that platform down there? That's where the tubing starts. So from opening until 11, kayaking and canoes can go down there with the tubes. But then from 11 to 5, it is closed for canoes and kayaks and it's just tubing. Here's a better shot of the manatee. You can see them under the water. They're under the log. I think that's, well, there's both of them, yep. Yeah. Ooh, the log, she's moving the log. I think that one's the mama, and then to the left is the baby. Mama just stuck her nose up to get some air. Now during the winter, during prime manatee season, there is no like snorkeling and tubing, but right now it's kind of the off season. Mama and baby here now, but during the winter, I had a lot of manatees, so not a lot of people are allowed to go snorkeling and swimming and scuba diving and subboarding and all those activities during the winter. Looks like she's using that log to scratch her back. There she goes right now. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Now, since it is before 11 a.m., we could go down this way, paddle if we wanted to, but since we brought the tubes, we'll tube that way later. We're gonna head back, go the other way now. Here's one of the boardwalk overhangs I was telling you about where you could hang out and look at the manatee. You can look and watch, but don't feed. So it is free to launch your own vessel. No charge for Nikki and I to launch the kayak and sub board. They do rent here. Kayaks, sub boards, canoes. We'll give you pricing information when we get back to the launch area. This is a lot of water. Many people will take out their own private boats. There's someone in their own pontoon boat right now. But we've seen several different types of boats out already. For me, pontoon boat. You cruise the water in comfort. John Candy and Outdoors. Dan Aykroyd, he wanted the speedboat. Actually, I think that one's a rental. They got their music going, fishing rods, and I'm sure a cooler of cold beverages. Oh, cool. Look back this way, it's all like marshy and stuff. Wild Florida nature. So now we're just gonna paddle around, let Nikki enjoy. Uh, her life's been a little hectic lately, so just let her relax and paddle at her own pace and enjoy some Florida nature. She loves her paddleboard. She would do this like every day if she could. Oh, this one, they got a doggy. It's a puppy boat. Oh, puppy. Puppy's loving it. It's just a doggy. Nikki's just sitting here watching this bird. I'm gonna name it Kevin. Hey, Kevin. Like the sign says, Manatee Zone, 
slow speed. I think it's time to turn around. We'll head back, inflate the, uh, the tubes. And we're gonna crash it. No, we're not gonna crash. We are. Ooh, good maneuver, Nikki. We didn't crash. <laughs> Would have been an incident. Almost an incident. But we're turning around, heading back to the launch area. We turned around at the right moment. Right up ahead there is an alligator directly in our path had we continued. That would have freaked Nikki out. Check out this little nook I found for myself. In the shade with pretty trees. Time for a snack break. In case you're ever here, wanna know where that spot is? C73, it's right around the corner there. Okay guys, we are back on land. We're going to deflate our items here and then I'll head down and I'll show you all the rental information. Now that we have that all packed up, I can give you the rental information in case you don't bring your own equipment. And by the way, for a kayak and canoe launch and subboard launch, it's the very last parking lot. There's closer parking lots for snorkeling and tubing. Well, look at this. The canteen is open. After I show you the rental information and before we go tubing, perhaps we should eat. I worked up an appetite kayaking, did you? Oh yeah, I didn't even eat breakfast this morning. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get hangry, we, we better hurry. <laughs> Here's the rental information, a single kayak, $22 for one hour, 38 for four hours, 50 for all day. A tandem kayak, one hour, $30, $449, and full day is 65. Canoe, 22 for one hour, four hours for $39, full day for 50, and a paddleboard. That's what Nikki did today, though she brought her own. A one hour rental is 22, four hours 38, and full day 50 bucks. Well check this out, there's a sandwich board of all the food. Burgers, cheeseburgers, pork sandwiches, grilled chicken, meatball sub, sausage sub, Nathan's hot dogs, sides of mac and cheese, chili, soup of the day, pretzels, drinks such as fruit smoothies and sodas, and ice cream. Dippin' Dots with assorted ice creams. Well, look at this along the way. A nice old southern house. We'll investigate after we eat. I think this is gonna be a pretty walk. Please note the sign. Please take nothing but pictures. Leave nothing but footprints. I'll let you guys enjoy the view. Check out this statue of a manatee. Very pretty with the tile. Let's take a selfie by it on the way back. I am hungry. We've made it. Blue Spring Canteen. Let's eat. So I'm getting a cheeseburger for $9. Nikki's getting a corn dog for four. And some chips and a soda. The soda's like two dollars and fifty cents. The water's a couple bucks, but hopefully you guys can see the rest of the pricing. The most expensive item is the cheeseburger at nine dollars. Here's my little state park cheeseburger. Nikki's classic looking corn dog. All done with lunch. All I can say is bring your own food. The food wasn't so hot, wasn't so good. I ate just enough of it to keep me from starving. On the way back, there are some informational boards. This one's gonna give you the history of Blue Spring. Became a state park in 1972. We've paused here on the way back because there's a manatee right there. That kayaker went right over it. Probably didn't even notice it. Right underneath her. Yeah, went right under that other kayak now. Oh my goodness. There, now we can see her easy. She's going into the tubing area. <laughs> Here's an informational board on the boardwalk. We've seen a lot of the gar. The house, as we saw earlier, is the Thursby House. Built in 1872, 
you can actually walk inside of it and take a look. We might do that after uh, the tubing and stuff. Time to test out some Christmas presents we haven't gotten to. Blowing up the River Run inner tube with my new electric pump. The tubes are ready. I have the GoPro. I'm not taking the Canon tubing. So from now on, GoPro mode. Now for the tubing, we have to walk all the way down to the mouth of the spring. The thing is, for the kayaking and the subboarding, we had to park in the far parking lot. The rest of the activities near the mouth of the spring, the other side of the state park. If you don't bring your own tube, they do have tube rentals. I think the cheapest one for the smallest amount of time is $7 for one hour, all the way up to $27 for all day for a double floaty. Follow the Brown Deck Road. Follow the Brown Deck Road. And we've made it. Tube and diver entry this way. Please note the sign. Danger, submerged hazards. Swim at your own risk. What's this say? Don't swim with alligators? Breaking news, do not swim with alligators. I'm shorter than you. <laughs> but first. There you go. Well, <laughs> I give it a seven, the Russian judge a three. <laughs> this is nice. I like these floaties. You liking the river run? Yeah, I like the word attached. Yeah, I, I bungee us together. <laughs> we have like no like rudder or control. We should have brought a paddle. So what does Blue Springs mean to me? This is a place I used to come, Nikki, as you know, a teenager or a young man. Mainly after I would like, uh, my buddies and I would leave Daytona Beach or New Summer Beach, come to the spring and cool off. I mainly did snorkeling here. We like never did tubing, we would snorkel. But I'm doing everything with you. Just floating on down. These are your Cadillacs of floaties. <laughs> yes, they are. I like that it has like the net around the donut hole? Yes, for sure. <laughs> I don't want to fall all the way through. <laughs> Me either. And the little backrest thing's nice. It is. I'm like, I can take a nap. Gosh. Yeah, these have cup holders, and I like the little uh, loops here where I can uh, bungee us together. Yeah, me too. It comes with a string that you can use, but, you know, I'm a bungee guy. Yeah, the bungees are awesome. <laughs> so this, my friends, is actually my view at the moment. Head back on the headrest, looking up at the sky. This is Florida spring water, so the water temperature is 72 degrees year round. Nice little tubing run. Yes, it was a lot of fun. Very relaxing. Your dismount was better than your entry. <laughs> I went, I did a belly flop for the entry, but that exit, you didn't get it, but it was smooth. It was smooth. I look like a professional. <laughs> Let's go grab the snorkel here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we are ready to snorkel. Um, I'm interested to see how this goes because they changed the entry point for snorkeling since I was a kid or a teenager. And we're starting to get some raindrops. Now see, back in my day, we could enter the water over there. Okay, we've entered the water. We're gonna go the opposite way from tubing because the mouth of the spring is, is this way. That's what I'm familiar with. So I'm just not familiar with entering the water here. This is not Crystal River. We can't swim with the manatee here, Nikki. I know. I know you're used to that now. No, you have to stay pretty far away here. The rules yeah. are a little different here than at Crystal River. Yeah, yeah she, they have a little protector there on the kayak. Yes. Protecting the manatee. So we've made it to the mouth of the spring. It's right there. And this is really, really deep over there where the water's really dark. 
I could have sworn when I was a teenager, like this was the entry point where we would come, because I would just come swim in this area, snorkel above the mouth. But uh, this is how it is now. But you can actually walk the whole way from the entry point. You can walk down here until you get to the mouth there, and then that's going to be super deep, and it's really, really going to push you up. It's a strong, strong current. It's already deep. How about this little rainstorm? <laughs> we did this in the right order today. I mean, we're already stuck from the spring, but it kind of hurts. It's a perfect floor today. It is. We got a little bit of sun, a little bit of wind, and now we got some rain. Although I'm getting all wet now. It's stinging rain. <laughs> Big fat rain. <laughs> no, it's stinging. I love walking in the rain. Like a kid playing in the rain. Oh! See everyone taking shelter. Any type of shelter they can find. I'm just walking in the rain now. Take a look at this, everybody. Oh, it's really coming down. It is really coming down. I have to put on my goggles to walk to the Jeep. I know. <laughs> Now's a good time to explore the house. Let's go check out the house. Oh, boy. This is fun, though. We've made it into the Jeep. We, we somehow, Nikki somehow dried off and changed in the Jeep. I went to the men's room and changed. I did that was, okay. That was smarter. I didn't worry about anyone seeing her because the windows fogged up so fast. It, did. it, was, it, was, it was a she, hot box. She was safe. She was safe. <laughs> Let's go get some ice cream. And we've made it. And the rain has stopped. We've made it to Jeremiah's Italian Ice. Let's get some ice cream and wrap up this day. Well, here's mine. Strawberry Italian Ice. Banana Italian ice and vanilla ice cream. What you got? I got the cake batter and vanilla. Okay, let's do this. Well, I enjoyed my ice cream. Nikki, the cake batter, not so much. No, it's too sugary. But you know what she did enjoy? The whole rest of the day. I did. Can I tell you my favorite part? <laughs> Please do. The paddle boarding. I loved it. There was so much space to move and we got to see manatee and then we went down these little alcoves and stuff it was great that was my favorite part a lot of stuff to do at blue spring state park yes um they have cabins they have campsites mm -hmm. we did like the sup boarding the kayaking the snorkeling tubing and the tu yeah the little tubing rafting thing oh so fun a lot of stuff to do there i'm gonna leave a link 
to its website. Yes, for everything you can do. <laughs> you might do. You might want to do some other stuff we didn't do. <laughs> You'll learn all about it. But you see what we did today, and it was pretty fun. It was a lot of fun. And as always, adventures out there. You'll find it on a road trip. The back of the Jeep is a disaster. I was just throwing stuff back there. Ay, ay, ay. I might need the bigger Jeep. <laughs>